In this video I'm going to show you how to copy some pictures onto your Inatab 2S. Uh, most of what you're going to work on is through the Learning Lodge Navigator. This is available through vtech.com or it should have come on a CD inside your vtech, uh, inside your Inatab 2. So first thing you want to do is start this up. Then you want to connect your Inatab with the uh, USB cable they gave you and you want to connect it to your computer and when you connect it, the picture that's on the end of tab should go away and start looking like this. It says connected to computer. Then your computer should recognize that it's connected and it should hopefully start figuring it out. Well, maybe. We'll go ahead and select on Click on the end of tab 2S and the kid. Oh, there it comes. I should have waited just a second more. It, it, when the Learning Lodge Navigator is turned on, it, sh it should see the end of tab 2S connect automatically. And right now it's talking to the end of tab, pulling off any kind of data, the, uh, the uh, application records of where your kids have been playing, and some other stuff. Still says connected to computer. Still says loading. Oh, there we go. All right, over here on the left side, you want to click on File Manager. And this thing does not like to focus close, but click on File Manager. All right, and here are the pictures that are already on it, and these are the pictures that are on your computer. And you want to come down, find a picture that you like, select it, put the check mark there. Uh, put the check mark beside a couple more and let's see so then once you have all the ones selected that you like then you hit this arrow and it, the right arrow and it pushes it over to the in a tab and there the transfer begins and now they should be over here on the in a tab now up here at the top it tells you how much space you have uh, free to add and use this, this green represents how much space you have left so this one has quite a bit of space left uh, then you can see all your pictures here and so once you turn in a tab back on they should be there so I'll go ahead and do that go ahead and hit the home button to get out of hit the home button to get out of there we'll unplug the in a tab Turn it off so it gets out of the computer mode. Turn it back on. Oops, sorry. And uh, the pictures along, all the pictures you put on with the Learning Lodge Navigator and all the pictures your kid takes with his, uh, with the camera should all be in the same, same location. And this, amazingly, the stylus is still here. not been lost yet. Unbelievable. Touch your name to and make sure you touch the same account that you chose on the uh, computer otherwise your pictures may not show up. Hello. Alright, we'll go over to the to photos. photos section. The photos app. And then all the photos you selected should be on here. Now if you select one, it's going to go a lot faster than if you select a hundred. Oh yeah, here's one of them. And if it will ever start, there it is. And it should, yep, and it should auto-rotate when you turn it one way or the other. And has a little cool animation. So anyway, that's how you put them on the photos. You got to get them on your computer. Then you start up the Learning Lodge Navigator, uh, plug in your in a tab, and then go to click on the account that you want to put the pictures on for, and then 
uh, click on file manager select the pictures you want and push the right arrow and it copies them all over at that point you should be good to go thanks